Yo, what's going on, Sexy Simulator Squad? Today we're here doing a ranked 1v1. As you can see, I still got the Patreon, boys. So if you want to, make sure you click the first link in the description below and the uh, linked or pinned, sorry, link in the comment section below. And you can come to the Patreon to support me if you want to. If you don't want to, don't worry about it. But you do get a bunch of exclusive stuff like my five minute surrenders for the day, all of the polls to vote on what gods I'm playing. You get a uh, uh, personalized thank you card. You get 1v1s. You get priority in fight clubs. You get um, coaching sessions. Man, you just get everything. You get everything. So it's worth it. It's worth it. I'm playing Hun Bats. Basically, today is Sunday, which means it's Shiv Sunday, but Shiv is not here to tell me what gods she played. So, yesterday she told me what gods she wanted me to play, and those gods are... Um, I'm starting like this again because like, I feel like there's no point in trying to fight him because I will just die. Ay, 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 ay. Um, <clears throat> she told me what god she wanted me to play last night, and those gods are, quote, any assassin except Susano. And Set was like, I guess, meant also when she said Susano. I've been playing Susano a lot, though, recently. I just really enjoy playing him. Like, I, it's so weird with Susano because I hated playing him. Like, I hated it. I just, basically, I just surrendered immediately every time i played him and um now i love him because like it was shiv's birthday one day and she wouldn't tell me what she wanted which was pissing me off she's like i don't want anything i'm so blessed you know um like the girl good girl she is but i wanted to get her something and so what she said was if you pick susano and you win the game I will tell you what I want for my birthday. And so I picked Susano and I dialed the fuck in. I was like, I was like Neo on Susano, on like some Susano shit, you know? Basically what I'm saying was, I played like, I actually knew how to play the character. And because of that, I actually ended up winning. And, um, I mean, it was awesome. What can I say? I felt really cool afterwards. Alright, you about to hit me like that. Whatever, bitch. Your middle tower is under attack. I'm pretty sure I most definitely cannot fight him. Um, but... Not gonna stop me from trying. <laughs> So he used his pots. Why is he level 5? Bucket. Alright. Easy. We got alt for alt and relic for relic. End of the day, we ended up being even. So that was really good. That was really good. In fact, we're a little bit ahead of even because he missed a few minions back in a little bit too early. Hell yeah, boys. Damn, you got it. Alright. There's no, uh, like, big dick thing on the map for me to do, so I'm gonna just chill here. Good mood activated. Good mood activated. Oh, da, 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 da. That's pretty cringy. Am I actually okay with like fighting this? I think I am. Hmm. 
Easy. Absolutely easy. I don't know how else you want me to say it. I'm amazing at this video game. I had blue buff, so he thought because his alt wasn't up, my alt wouldn't be up. Think again, sucker. Hit him with the Yaga Yeet. Alright, so as you can see, by the pretty primed up gameplay that I'm showing, um, I'm basically a Hunbat's main at this point. I have no mana though. Hmm. What? Okay. I think they need to make the hitbox... A little bit smaller on the uh, on this ability not because I just threw it into the wall because I know that I just threw it into the wall but because I think the hitbox gets blocked by a lot of shit that it shouldn't I get this wall right here this shouldn't get blocked by this auto attacks go through this wall right here so why would my three not you know just a little quality of life change, I think, that they should add. Yaga. Holy shit, that did so much damage. Ow. Oh. Alright, he missed a whole wave. I'll take it. Well, I tried, in case you're wondering what happened. Which, I mean, let's be honest. Why wouldn't you be wondering what happened? When I altered the fucking wall? Well, let me tell you. Let me explain myself. Basically, I tried to teleport to my 3 and then ult, but my 3 teleport didn't go off and then my ultimate did. And if that's not the most sad thing you've heard all day, then I'm sorry. I really am. Oh, walk into a wall. Dude, walls are my fucking biggest enemy in Smite. Enemies? No thanks. I can handle them all. World Champion, Bronze 5. The whole scale. What I can't handle is a fucking wall. Oh, hello. I do have pots ticking me up pretty quick right now, so I think I'll stay actually. Because he doesn't have beads either, so. There we go, and we got the red buff too. Have at it, ya fiend. Oh, I just realized he didn't go boots. He's slow as shit. I'm gonna go Hydras. I feel like I don't need defense yet. I do need blink though. Blink is insane on, on, on bats. I can three him, and then he'll pre-beats again, and then I can blink on him after an ult. I do a lot of damage. Where is he? 
What the? Wow. Dude, maybe I'm a Hun Bats main. Holy shit. Maybe I'm an Assassin main. I'd be claping Chekes with Assassins. Alright, I'm gonna go back. Ah, uh, no, I'll get the tower first and then I'll go back. Um, does he have beads up? Because if he does, the play I'm about to make is really stupid. Well, turns out it was stupid. You bitch. Alright, did it. It actually wasn't as stupid as I thought. We're making it, boys. Get out of here. Get this. Get breastplate. And lo and behold, it's the exact same build as last game. Except I had, I do have Warrior's Blessing instead of Attacker's Blessing. I really like this start, by the way. I really, really like the blue buff with mana or HP Chalice start. Like, much more than I like one HP pot fighting for red for no reason. Now, don't get me wrong, he does a lot of damage, but he can't he can't keep up that damage. You know, like, his burst is better than mine, but my consistent damage is better than his, which is weird because he's a hunter, but it's the truth. Also, he doesn't have beads. Now that probably was not necessary, considering the fact that he was in his base for about 30 seconds, so I easily could have just done the bull demon, but it made me feel good. got scared all right let's just get the phoenix in i definitely don't need minions to get this beans we won the game I don't think my alt does that much damage but I'm gonna use it anyways all right there we go GG man the hun bats W if you guys enjoyed that video make sure to like comment and subscribe and until next time guys peace